Sports director Chris Matthews is here to explain who's coming to find <laughs> those diamonds in the rough. And a lot of them are coming here. Yes, indeed. The, uh, when the recruiters come to the Valley, they're finding lots of gems, many of them no longer hidden. Recruiters are finding a gold mine of talent right here in the desert. Each year, the Las Vegas Sun scouts the Valley's best talent. Not too many years ago, and you had a few teenage blue chip athletes turning heads in Vegas, but those days are long gone. You know, the high school football players in this valley continue to get bigger, better, and stronger, and they're being recruited by all the top universities in the country. And, you know, we get a coach call from Stanford, and you get coaches from Oklahoma on campus. By Alabama, Oregon, Oklahoma. Oregon, Texas. You get guys from UCLA. You get guys from everywhere across the country. Las Vegas prep football is no longer a quick stopover for college recruiters. It's a destination, not the size of Texas, Florida, or California, but it's becoming a recruiting paradise. Gorman's Nick Gates is the number one football recruit in the state, but he also plays baseball. It's all pretty exciting, pretty fun, you know. It's a little stressful at first because I didn't know which one I was going to do, baseball or football, but I still don't know yet, but I'm going to pick here soon probably. Whichever sport he chooses, he'll have a ton of choices where to play. Not only Gates, but all these guys are being recruited to play football beyond high school. Some have committed. Tyrell Crosby has committed to Oregon, but Florida and USC continue to badger the teenager. It's kind of crazy. I wasn't expecting it. Noble Hall was also expecting to be hounded by recruiters, so he committed to San Diego State. Know, I'm thinking they backed off because usually I have coaches call me every day. No calls since I committed. No letters came in. So. However, for most of these players, the offers continue to pour in. Matthew McDermott has an offer from UNLV. If I choose to go there, it's going to be an awesome, exciting adventure. So what do you mean if? Um, I, I'm not putting all my eggs in one basket. I'm going to wait to see the, how the season goes, and uh, I'm not discounting anybody. Or they all have choices. Each one is different, but they all have one thing in common. Not surprisingly, it's the answer to the question, how I spent my summer vacation. It's all been football. Football and baseball. Football all day. Football camps. Oh, yeah. Never stops for the top football guys. It becomes a year-round activity. Prep football practice begins August 15th. Gorman's already started practicing. They got a game in three weeks. And by the way, UNOV opens practice next week already. Incredible. Never too soon to start to talking talk. about football. <laughs> Never too soon. That's right. Thanks, Chris. <laughs>